<laughs> well, I never heard it put that way, but go ahead. How do you listen yeah, to this yes, green yes. man? It makes sense sometimes. Uh, listen, I was wondering, what's your take on these human-monkey hybrids I've been hearing about lately? How much further? I think it's this turn up ahead. around. Let's get back to the car. We're out here trying to save our marriage and you don't even care. Sure I do. Keep your strength. Tim, baby, wake up. Welcome back to the show. This is Jesse Sampson, and uh, we're taking a few calls here today. And uh, go, uh, call or go ahead. Hey, Jesse, it's Steve. 
Tim, wake up. I found the car. But you need to come with me now and be quiet. Here's another whistleblower. It would be Bill, Bill Cooper. He was blowing the whistle since the 70s. He saw uh, UFO technology uh, in the Vietnam War, and he was told to be quiet about it. And he decided he was not, and he was approached and said, you know, be quiet or else, you know, you're going to get killed. And in 2001, he was found dead with a, a bullet to the back of his head. And basically what he was saying is that we have technologies uh, that, that help the human race, basically. All right, let's, let's, let's take another call. Hi there, uh, Jesse. This is uh, Greg over in uh, Arvada. Look, I've I've been listening to you for years. I love your show, man. But listen, I've really taken some offense to some of the stuff you're saying about AIDS, man. My brother-in-law has AIDS, and for you to say the government is knowingly poisoning our citizens is just disgusting. How can you say that? How could I say that? Well, wow, good question. <laughs> you got me, caller. <laughs> How can I say for sure? Well, looking at the AID virus itself, uh, it's... Uh, a ...privately held company, which would lead me to the IRS. Are you ready for the truth? Jesse Sampson. What I wanted to talk about uh, uh, in this segment is time travel. Some retreat, huh? 